today was so awesome. I'm glad we met Ariel. When you're curious, there's a lot you can learn. If you never stretch your fins, you can miss out on discovering new things and new ideas. There was something else I learned about because I was curious. What is it? I'll show you. That was so awesome, isn't it? Hi there, welcome to the Disney Courage and Kindness Club. I'm Elena. And I'm Malia. All week long, we'll be talking to Disney princesses and learning how they show courage and kindness. I'm so excited to learn from them. Me too. All of the princesses are so courageous and kind. That's why we look up to them. They inspire us to be better. Exactly. And today, we'll be meeting with Ariel. Ariel's curiosity led her to find some really cool gadgets and gizmos. She loves exploring the ocean and discovering new items. And she loves learning about the human world. She wouldn't even let her fins stop her from doing that. <laughs> Which is why I'm so excited she invited us over today. She's going to teach us all about being adventurous, courageous, and curious. She's the perfect person to, perfect mermaid to, She's just perfect to teach us all those things. <laughs> well, I'm ready if you are, Malia. Ready, let's go. Hi, Ariel, nice to meet you. I'm Elena. And I'm Malia. Thank you so much for inviting us today. I'm so glad you're here. I love meeting new humans. <laughs> <laughs> we love all of the beautiful items you've collected. Do you have a favorite? Gosh, it's hard to pick a favorite from so many wonderful things. Got the dingle hopper and the gizmos and the thingamabobs. You know what? I can't decide. <laughs> but with each thing in my collection comes with the adventure it took to find it. I think that may be the best part. You have the best collection of things because you're so adventurous and very curious. Well, when you're curious, there's a lot you can learn. If you never stretch your fins, you can miss out on discovering new places, new things, and new ideas. Sometimes it takes a bit of courage to swim to the surface, but it's worth it. And I'm pretty lucky to have a best friend like Flounder. Even when he's getting cold fins, he'll still swim by my side wherever my adventure takes us. <laughs> Flounder is such a good friend. Yeah, he's so supportive. Speaking of friends, your curiosity has inspired me. I'm usually shy to make new friends, but because of you, I feel more comfortable getting to know the kids in my class. That's amazing, Malia. Thanks, Elena. That's fantastic, Malia. Sometimes that can be hard, even under the sea. But if you're kind and friendly, you can learn so much from every fish and friend you meet, especially seagulls. <laughs> Take Scuttle. He's always teaching me everything he knows about the humans. Scuttle is great. He knows a lot. You're right. When you meet new people, you can learn from them. That's the best part. <laughs> what about you? Is there anything neat you've learned from being curious? I was always very curious about musical instruments, so I learned how to play the flute. Whenever I play it for my family, they like to dance to it. <laughs> wow, Elena, that sounds a lot like a snarf blast. <laughs> when Eric was playing the first time I saw him, Gosh, I just love music. It's probably because we have the best court composer in the whole ocean, Sebastian. <laughs> I love Sebastian. His music makes me want to dance. <laughs> me too. I think that's why he's the best. And what about you, Malia? Is there anything you've learned from being curious? I read a lot of books to learn about new places and the people that live there. So I'm always curious about what their life is like. Do you ever wish to be part of their world? Uh, yeah. <laughs> then we have that in common. I was always curious to see what the human world was like. It took a big adventure for me to find out. <laughs> when I'm a little bit older, I'll be able to be adventurous, just like you, and visit all of the places I've been learning about. I bet you can be adventurous now, just in different ways. Maybe stay clear of sharks, though, and <laughs> sea witches. <laughs> Thanks, Ariel. We will. <laughs> well, Ariel, thanks for inviting us today. But I think it's time Lee and I go find some gadgets and gizmos of our own. That sounds like a great idea to me. Thanks for swimming by. I hope you both always stay curious. It's so wonderful. Thanks, Ariel. We will. Tell Sebastian I love his music. Oh, I sure will. It'll make his day. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. Bye. We just met Ariel. And neither.
neither can I. She's so adventurous. And free-spirited. And funny. She's just awesome. I just remembered that there was something I learned about because I was curious. What is it? Well, last year, my best friend taught me American Sign Language. She had to learn it because one of her family members is deaf. I was so curious about it after seeing it on TV, and she was willing to teach me signs. I know a few signs, but I've been super nervous to actually do it in front of people. That's so awesome. Would you feel comfortable doing it now? Because I would love to learn. Really? Yeah, absolutely. That would be so cool. Well, like Ariel said, she learns more when she's curious and open to new experiences, not when she sticks to the same things she's used to. Exactly. This is how you say, hello, how are you? Wow, how did you do that? I'll show you. Are you ready? Hello, hello how, how are you? you? Amazing, Elena. That was so awesome. Isn't it? You know what would be so cool? What if we did some signs for words we talked about today? Like courage. Oh, great idea. This is how you say it. courage. Courage. Great job, Elena. Let's do kindness now. Ooh, one more. We have to do the word of the day. Curiosity. You're right. Curiosity. You got it. Malia, that was so awesome. Right? That's how I felt when I first learned it. I was just so curious about it after seeing someone doing it on TV. And now I know so many signs. I want to learn them all. So do I. I'm definitely going to practice these and learn some more. We can learn them together. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> well, being curious worked in Ariel's favor. And now look, it's working for us. <laughs> <laughs> Today was so awesome. I'm glad we met Ariel. Yeah, me too. Slender might say it was fantastic. It was the best. She made me feel confident to finally do American Sign Language in public. Yeah, and you're so good at it. Thank you for teaching me. Now I'm curious to learn more about it because you were curious to learn more about it. Thanks, Elena. I think if we continue to be curious and have the courage to explore new experiences, we will learn so much more about things we love. Absolutely. Well, I think that's all the time we have for today. How do you, Princess? I'm Elena. And I'm Leah. Thank you for watching this special episode of the Disney Courage and Kindness Club. See you next time. Bye! Bye.